Hello friends, it's Astro here and welcome back to the Needy Nerds prison where today we have failed. We have failed our prison, we have failed our prisoners, we have failed our guards. And now it's time for us to be ushered past all of these burning barrels, past all of the boxes of cabbage and potatoes, get brought into here where we can be stripped off and show off our little tiny butt crack, woo, and get shoved into our own prison. So here we are. I've made some slight modifications to the prison, um, mainly around the broken new cell block down the bottom, because I, uh, I have actually tried to escape from this one once before, and after getting bumped up into maximum security, it then relocated me into one of those prison cells, which didn't really work, um, because I was able to just walk straight out, because that area has not been engineered correctly. So what I did was just roll back a little bit, remove the assignment of rooms down there, and now we're only in the prison proper. So, no hacks, no cheats. This is going to be a legit escape attempt where we try and get out of this place as alive as we possibly can. I mean, I can make it out dead. That's easy. Like, there's the, the morgue just up there where we can uh, make our way out via one of those lovely marble tables. But, oh my goodness. Look at the jostling in this corridor. All right, so that's a lesson for next time. When I'm building a, a prison that's this size... I need to allow corridors that are wider than two. Like, I thought two was going to be big enough. Oh, hello. Okay, great. I thought two was going to be wide enough for this place to, uh, you know, to do what I needed to do. But evidently, it's not. The amount of traffic that's going down that main corridor, that should be like four, four squares wide. So that people don't bump into each other. Because every time people jostle into each other, that's when the, the frame rates seem to seem to go because they have to recalculate their path the whole time um no don't push me in there okay so <clears throat> how are we going to do this how are we going to get out of this bad boy i mean the most logical way is to avoid the shotguns that are going on in here that's a great thing to do the most logical way is to get ourselves a lighter and cause a giant fire that then you know tears down half of the prison and it allows me to get out but the only place to get a lighter is from one of the offices up here, and that's all staff only, so getting up there is going to be very difficult, or from the visitation room down here. And because I've come in at normal security, and the visitation room was locked from the get-go to minsec only, I can't get in there either. So, I mean, I could, I could try, I could give it a crack, but I don't think that it's going to be a good idea. I tell you what, here's what we're going to do right off the bat. I'm going to try just legging it straight out the front door. I'm going to wait for a moment where the two doors are open, right, by these workmen that are sort of jostling to and fro. And here we go. Do a little run. Oh, we've been tased immediately. There are too many guards floating about. And quite frankly, then you have the uh, the snipers out there as well. I can, I can give that one more try just to see if... Uh, have I been handcuffed? I can't see. I'm... There's sandwiches in the way of me seeing whether or not I've been hanged. Yes, I have. Okay, great. So, we'll, uh, we'll get taken back to our cell. Um, and we'll see what we can do about maybe giving either that another attempt. Or, we're going to have to try... Oh, my goodness me. Okay, I'm going to... Sorry, I'm going to go back to down to normal speed. Or at least to two speed. Because the jostling is a little bit too extreme at the moment. It's a little bit too much to bear. Okay, so we're going to go back to our cell. We're going to spend two hours floating about in here. It shouldn't be too hard with the uh, the wonders of, uh, of quick speed, of uh, four times speed, we should be able to, uh, we should be able to spin through this rather quickly. Now, it seems to me that if I can't get access to lighters, then the best way for us to get out is going to be probably destroying as much as we possibly can causing as much of a ruckus as possible it's immediately like i'm probably going to have to kill some people to get some points and then i'm going to have to start recruiting a big old gang so that i can then cause mega destruction yeah i mean there's tasers going off left right and center around here it's it's going to be it's going to be interesting i have to say all right so here's the max sec area um we can see some weights being lifted up there they seem to be uh, they seem to be enjoying themselves that's quite nice so what we're going to do is we're going to get in here, we'll ignore this guard, uh, this uh, workman, we're going to find ourselves a drill. And then we're going to start drilling all the people and equipment that are in this room. Here it is. 
Oh, auto saving. Oh, no, come on, here we go. Great. Okie dokie. Let's do some drilling, shall we? Should we start with this workman, or should we just start? We'll just start with, um, start with some tabley things, um, and we'll just start, you know, as much destruction as we can right off the bat. Um, oh, hang on, there's a guard here. Oh my goodness me! Okay, I was not expecting the shotgun to get brought out that quickly, but I guess it's kind of, you know. You kind of have to expect that sort of thing. Okay, three points. Shall we get a second boy? I think we can hire someone up with uh, with three points up our sleeve. Okay, Steven, you're a skilled fighter. You should come with me. And Hancock, how much do you cost? Four points. Okay, I could have afforded you, but it's too late now. We're gonna we're gonna do with Shelley. Shelley's gonna be my first recruit, and he and I are gonna go back into the workshop. Should we go to the workshop, or should we get ourselves some knives? Whatever the case may be, I think we need to do... Huh. That's out of bounds. Oh, I must have marked that one as staff only. Oh, we're in the wrong the wrong corridor here, Shelly. Come on, mate. We're going to go back around this way, past the shop. Excuse me, coming through. Um, longingly, longingly look at all of the chocolate and stuff that's here because we've got no money to our name. I think that uh, um, the console version of Escape Mode looks a lot more full-featured than the... Uh... Okay, here we go, Shelly. We're going to do this. It looks a lot more full-featured than this version. No, I wanted the I wanted the drill. I mean, I can have both. That's fine. But it's time for some murdering, Shelly. Let's get him. All right, cool. We'll get some good points up and running here. Get this guy quick. All right, and this one? No. All right, we've injured a couple of people. Let's do some damage. We'll do some lunging. Oh, yeah, Shelly. Come on, mate. We got him. We can get these guys. We'll just drill them all. Do as much damage as we... Oh. Oh, I've been captured. Shelly's on. Come on, Shelly. You can do it. You can do it, mate. Get us some, get us some more points. Some more... Ca uh, oh. Okay. Captured again. But we now have five points. Okay, let's skip it up. I'm going to go into maximum security now, aren't I? No? I've been shoved into... Oh, I'm still Shelly. All right. Let's flip back to me. And I'm just wandering the corridors at the moment, apparently. Uh, which is fine. It's, it's totally fine. But we need to find some friends. We need to find some friends with which we can play. So let's uh, let's meander up this away. Um, should we just... Ah, here we go. Let's just do it this way. All right. So... Oh, I've got a great idea. Oh, I've got a brilliant idea. Okay, hey, McBean. Right. McBean, I need you to do me a solid, my friend. Yeah, that's right. We don't need you for anything other than being a lighter mule. Right? You feel me? You're going to go down. Yeah, that's it. You're going to get down into the old visitation block. And then we're going to rendezvous, probably in here, I would say. We're going to rendezvous, hand over the lighter, and then I'm going to set some fires. I'm going to cause some havoc. Okay, here, here we go. Here we go. Do a little, a little cheeky stroll through here. Look at this dude. Look at them. The, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Hang on. Hand, uh, don't follow. Don't follow. No, don't follow. Okay. We're going to try and get this lighter. And we're just being very quiet. There's nothing to see here. Nothing to see here, guards. I didn't I didn't mean to, to have myself following there. Hopefully that doesn't cause me some some grief and or lockup experiences. But alright. We're just gonna search around. I'm gonna increase the aha! Look. Alright. Put that away. Alright, here we go. We're gonna stealth our way. Back through here. Excuse me, fellows. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. We come back out of here. Uh oh, there's a metal detector. Are we going to be able to make it through? We are. Let's just let's just see what we can do about quickly. Oh, jeez. Are these guys following me? No, they're on break. All right. Okay. Don't mind me, guys. Don't mind me. What we're going to do is we. Damn it! Don't take it. Please don't take it. Please don't find it. Okay, great. All right. Let me go. Can you let me go? Don't... Oh, they took my lighter. Jeez. All right. We're going to have to try that again. I want that lighter. I really do. Okay, McBean. Show us what you're made of. Let's get up to two speed here. And we're going to try that one more time. Because I really, really want... I mean, maybe. Maybe. We don't do the rendezvous. Maybe maybe McBean... Oh, where am I going? Maybe McBean can just start the fire. And then 
you know, we can move on from there. I think that might be okay. Let's do that. So we're going to work our way back down through the corridor here, back over into visitation. I'm not sure if it's still visitation time, but it seems that, yeah, it is. Okay, great. Um, well, it's the whole work-free time that uh, that became visitation. So that's, that's cool. They don't seem to be uh, too thrilled about having me just meandering about in this place, but that's okay. Just keep our eyes peeled. I mean, we got smokes, we got pills, and we're going to get searched, but hey, I haven't got anything. I don't know what you're talking about, boss. <laughs> Excellent. All right. Maybe I should do that, that cheaty thing that I've seen other people do by installing an auto clicker so that when I, um, when I do find a lighter, I can uh, create the, the mega giant fire that looks like it's being generated by an, an incredible space laser. Okay, cool. Here we go. Let's do the run. I'm going to get out through here and we're going to set a fire. Mm, let me into here. This is the perfect place. Okay. So we'll set ourselves a fire just to get ourselves underway. All right. All of this can be burned. All of this can be burned. Excellent. Excellent. This is the way I play Prison Architects. <laughs> this fire is in here already. We're going to cut them off. Oh, no. I've been tased. Okay, quick, Henderson. Let's go. The chaos is on. We're going to find our way down there. And we're going to see what we can do about capitalizing on this. Is the lighter still floating about? Can we pick it up? It was about... Where did I get captured? Was it up here? All right, let's get back to normal speed. Let's hope that it's just been dropped on the ground and I can just find it. Because that would make things so much easier. It doesn't look like that's the case. It looks like that lighter is now dust. It's history. It's gone. Which is a shame. Okay. Did we create enough destruction? We did not. We did create a breach into the, uh, the visitation area. But it was critically not enough to be able to then pour through and find more lighters. Hmm. Disappointing. Disappointing. Okay. Maybe. Oh my god, there's dead boys here. Okay. Maybe. We'll just quietly. Alright, Shelly, go back about your business. I'm going to go and recruit some more guys. We've got two points here. I'm going to see if I can find myself another Minsec guy. And we can just tag team the lighter attempt to get as much destruction underway as possible. Um, who we got here? Alright, what are you worth? Paul King. Five. Wow. Okay. Five. Alright. Um. This guy, nine, expert fighter. Oof, jeepers creepers. I'm kind of looking for someone. Um, is there any, I'm, a, I'm on a budget here, guys. I'm on a budget. I need a level two uh, blue guy. Anyone? Five, four, armed guard. Uh, let's not play with him. Um, okay, so I can't, I can't find anyone who has the correct amount of goodies. It does look like McBean's been released though, which is kind of nice. Okay, well... Should we, uh, should we just get some points then? All right, let's do that. We'll go over here and we'll just do some, some destruction, some burning of things or some, some breaking of things and see what we can do about generating some points that way. So we're going to get in here. We'll get ourselves... I really do want to drill. There we have it. Okay. Great. And then Shelly, go and grab that. Excellent. And McBean... Grab yourself a shank. Excellent. Okay, we're all armed. We're ready to go. Boys, let's get some damage in this place. All right, we'll see what we can do about... Ah, okay, here we go. Our first guest. Let's get him done. We'll get, some, we'll get some full killing going on. Okay, he's dead. That's great. I expect an armed guard to come in momentarily. Nope, there's some taser action going on. Excellent. And you know what? Once this guy's down, I'm going to destroy that metal detector. I've lost my whole crew. They're all down at the moment. Let's see what we can do about doing as much injury and damage as we possibly can. Maximize our point output. I'm just like clicking furiously with this drill. I don't have an auto clicker installed. It would probably help. But 14 points. We're going to go back into our cell. Into the smoky holding cell down here. Good. And we're going to find our way out. And find ourselves some new dudes. Um, oh, or is there a rumble going on? Should we have a rumble, chaps? Yes, we should. Ha ha ha. All right. Let's just break everything, shall we? Oh, my God. Okay, there's shotguns. There's shotguns happening. I can see the spray. 
I'm gonna break some toilets. And get some more destruction. Can we get some destruction points? Come on, let's go. Let's go. I'm hoping that the other guard the other the other prisoners that are up the top there, they're gonna take the heat for doing all of this destruction. They're gonna be the ones that get shotguns, and I can just be left to do as I please down here, breaking chairs. That sounds fun. Okay, so we've got gang members here who are sort of, you know, helping me to do the most amount of uh, distraction. And I can be left alone to destroy weights benches and a chair. That's right. I'm the chair killer. Oh, look at all these chairs that are dying by my hand. Excellent. Oh, oh, we are being followed. There's guarding inbound. We get, oh, we give him a little bit of a biff. And we'll get taste. Okay, great. But 19 points. This is good. This is good. We're going to go into go into, into there. We're going to sleep mode. Uh, we're going to jib the screen all dangerous like. Oh, no. I, oh, jeez. All right. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, that's happened again too. Okay, great. So, 33 points. Let's get some reps up and running here. I'm going to need a good amount of reputation, guys. Um, and I think you guys should have some as well. Why am I getting beaten? Um, hello? All right, what about if I do that? No? Okay, you're still hitting me. I do hope that you stop. Please don't beat me to death. I, I now have no option but to just sit here and take this beating. Can we get another guard to stop this guard, please? Thank you. No, seriously. Seriously, come on, don't leave. No, guys. No, don't kill me. This is not cool. Police brutality. Is a workman going to rescue? Look, I'm unconscious. She's still wailing on me. What the heck? Come on. Don't kill me, bro. Don't punch me. Oh, no. Seriously? Is this what's going to happen? Am I going to die lying on the floor? She's finally she's finally gotten it out of her system. My God. That was brutal. I didn't even do anything. I just, like, teleported into my cell, and then she decided that she was going to, like, decimate me. Rough. Okay. I'm going to skip punishments. I'm going to flip over to Shelly and then flip back again. Okay, great. Reps. Let's get some more. I'll save. Should I save some more? No, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's crank things up. What I'm going to do is toggle this up. Um, and then I don't know why it flips out like that. I think it's because there are like, they're there. Like the, you know, the little flags that say that there's a tunnel or say that there's something to do. I think that they're still kind of there, but you can't click on them, if that makes any sense. So, all right, boys. Let's do some more destruction. <clears throat> we'll get ourselves... Ooh, laundry. We'll get ourselves into... Oh, I've come down the wrong corridor. Dang it, I do that all the time. All right, let's get ourselves some more murdering going on. Or, should we start a mega riot? We could start a mega riot, but there are armed guards in here that would mess with us. I like finding myself a quiet little nook where I can just like slink off and cause as much damage, preferably to staff rather than to other prisoners. And the workshop feels like a really nice place for that to happen. So we'll grab ourselves. I'll take a hammer. Uh, Shelly, you're an expert fighter, so I think you should get the shank this time. Or do you want to take the drill and show me how it's done? Because I evidently can't figure it out. I don't know if a hacksaw is really going to be the greatest of ideas. The drill might be better. And then McBean, you can grab yourself a screwdriver. Yeah, let's do it. Excellent. Okay. Now, first thing is first. We're going to take out this metal detector. All right. I mean, it's it's not necessary. Let's get down. Uh, we'll get down into here. We'll find our way into... Oh, hello. Oh, jeez. Oh, we've been done already. Oh, my goodness. Okay, all right. Oh my goodness, Shelly, my man. You're making me proud. Look at the destruction. He's just insta-killing people. Um, with this drill, my goodness me. Okay, look, everything I said about the drill was wrong. In the right hands, the drill is utterly fantastic. Or maybe it was just that I, um, I mean, I maxed out a bunch of my, my murdery things. And, uh, oh, there we go. Okay, here we go. It's down to McBean now. You've got some workmen to deal with, mate. Can you... No, okay. All right. Let's skip our punishments up. That's a good amount of points now. That's a great amount of points. We're all maximum security now. Let's get ourselves... Oh, Curtis, mate. You're mine. 
You are mine, son. Get in. And nice. Groovy. Okay. Let's foggle everyone. Foggle? Foggle tog toggle follow. Foggle tolo. Let's get everyone following up. And let's get down into... Ugh. I don't want to be dragged around. Where's Shelly? Shelly's here. Okay, great. Let's get everyone up to at least one point in everything. I'm going to go to full max for me. And what should we do? Deadly? I think Deadly is going to help us out across the board. As well as probably Instigator. So we can start getting some mega fights on the way. And I think Shelly should be tough and strong. And quick. And skilled fighter. I'm putting all my points into Shelly right now. He's my bro. He does really well. Okay. Guys, are you ready? Let's do this. There's a fight breaking out. Let's get ourselves a guard. Oh, jeez. All right, let's get a guard. And we'll see what we can do. Oh, there has there has been a rumble forming. Uh, there has been a rumble. A rumble has formed. Uh, let's get ourselves some more murdered guards. More murdered guards. Um, we'll just maximize our points here. There is a whole heap of shotgun shells firing about. Let's see what we can do about pruning out some of these guards. We don't need them. We don't need them at all. Can we get ourselves? No. Oh, no, Shelly. Oh, no. All right, McBean. Oh, oh, that was silly. B McBean and uh, Curtis is injured. All right. So, sadly, we lost Steve and Shelly and uh, Matt Knight. Both of them bought it trying to escape, uh, which is, is pretty disappointing. But honestly, that, that's my bad. That's my bad. I shouldn't have lurched into an area where there were a bunch of uh, a bunch of armed guards floating about and tried to start a rumble there. Okay, so what we're going to do is Shelly and Knight, I'm sorry, you did well, but critically, where am I going? You did well, but critically, it was not quite enough uh, to do what we needed to do. I am being escorted somewhere. Is it back to my holding cell? Oh, I see it's sleep time. Very well. Okay, I'll be a good boy. I'll be a good boy. You can lead me back in, and I'll uh, I'll have a little nap. How's that? I'll have a little nap. We'll get through sleep time. Um, I'm just going to hide down here in the corner, guys. Wait, what on earth? Look, love, this is unacceptable behavior. All right? You, are you the one that tried to kill me before? Because if you are, mate, that's just not cool. That's not cool at all. So what we're going to do is just hide down here in the corner. We're going to wait for guards and workmen to come down to see what we've done. Should I get these keys? No, I can't get them. I've destroyed them, evidently. Which is a bit of a problem, but that's fine. We, we, we can work around that. We'll get some destruction to, to trigger some more, um, I guess, workmen and guards to come down. That should be fine. Um, McBean has fallen unconscious straight off the bat, which is a bit disappointing. But, more chairs? Sure, why not? I don't want to kill my fellow inmates, you see. I could do. Maybe I could, like... Does breaking the radiator do anything cool? Like, it should, like, release a cloud of steam. That'd be fun. Get some toilets. Hey, McBean's back up and running. Excellent. Well, you can join us in the fight, my friend. Join us in the fight in destroying all the goodies here. I can hear some emergency services, which may mean some riot cops are on their way. Because there shouldn't be... Unless there's a fire somewhere else in the prison. Um, or unless the, uh, the AI has decided to bring in some... Hello. Here we go. Here we go. Get ourselves some more points here. Curtis is down. No, I saw him get tased. But uh, he, he he hasn't actually gone down by the looks of it. Or he's just resting. But we can get ourselves some of these guys. We've got to be careful of those shotgun armed guards up the top there. They will mess us up if we uh, if we get too close to them. But these regular guards, we, we can just, you know, have our way with them, right? We can just wail away on them as long as we fancy. Get some more points up our sleeve. Um, I wish I had something better than a baton to attack them with. The baton is not really, not really the best. Okay. Skip it up. McBean's up here, and I'm floating around down here. Okay, great. So, Sean Liversage. Poor dude. He got wrecked. Okay, let's see what we can do. We're going to get ourselves... My God, there's a lot of dead bodies in here. I think whenever we start a fight down here, it just tends to turn into a massive... Massive murder spree. Guards just open up and just have their merry way. Alright. Shall we try the lighter trick again? Hackett, you're my man. You are my man. I'm going to get you 
to go and find me a lighter, right? So we're going to turn off follow. Hackett's going to get out and see if he can do the old burninator trick, right? We'll get in, get a lighter, get out, and set some stuff on fire. We'll go up to two speed so we don't have to like spend too much time finding our way through this corridor. And we'll get in here, find ourselves. So there's smokes, there's a phone, there's some pills, some booze. I mean, under under better circumstances, that would be nice. But, I mean, we're trying to get out right now, okay? Um, more booze. Is there a lighter to be had? All right, not yet. It's funny how you just need to sort of walk back and forth um, and things will sort of change out. But I suppose there's, you know, people coming and going through here a lot. Aha. Okay, great. Here we go. Hack it. Let's do this. We're going to see what we can do about finding our way out through... Ah, oh, jeez. Jeez, come on, hack it. Someone bumped into him and it triggered him to fight. All right. Let's... Oh, look. Well, well, well. I'm right where I need to be. Right where I need to be to... Uh, oops. To get McBean and Curtis to come and join me for a little bit of kitchen-based destruction. Would that be nice? Now, I need to be careful. I need to be careful because I know that there's armed guards out in the uh, out in the, the canteen there, right? So we'll get wait for my buds to get here. Do I want to get everyone armed? I think the answer is yes, because that way we can do the absolute most destruction that is possible here. So, any more knives to be had, fellows? Hello, fellow cooks. I am just here cooking and washing dishes. Um, do you want me to wash your knife for you? Yes, it will be clean and shiny. And totally not covered with blood. Mm-hmm. Um, I can't seem to find another knife for McBean to use. Which is disappointing, to say the least. Alright. Um, let's just let's just do it. Let's just do it. Let's just get stuck in. We'll grab our knife out. We'll find ourselves some cooks. And we'll just, just get started. Here we go. This is standard play. Standard play. My boys are going to just go full fisty cuffs. I love that Curtis is a gang member, and so he immediately takes his shirt off as soon as the rumble begins. There's a guard here who's tried to tase me. We're going to sort... Uh-oh. All right, let's try and get this arm guard. Quick. Quick. No, nope, we didn't get him. Okay. All my boys are getting downed. Um, we're going to probably need to surrender here momentarily so that we don't get, um, so that we don't get too much risk. Uh, risk of murder. Oh, there is an armed guard here. Okay, can we... Nope. Alrighty. So that's the end of that run. Let's skip that up. I wonder. Do we just... I Can I just get this guy as well? Great. No worries. And anyone else here? Here's McBean. He's venting. Let's just get as big a crew as we can. And we'll start a riot. Tot Hill? How many people can I actually have? Okay, that's the max. Alright. So let's get some rep points into these boys so that they're a little bit more useful. Because, you know, the standard usefulness of these guys is fairly low. Um, some more? Some more. Skill fighter. Instigator. Deadly. Across the board. Strong. Tough. Quick. Can we afford everything? Almost. Almost. Um, okay, so we're one notch away from that. Let's see what we can do. Okay, hack it was potentially not a great idea because he's just been released. Um, so I guess we can... I'm a bit disappointed then, Hackett. I just dumped a bunch of points into you and you've been released. All right, well, I guess good for you. Get off my list. All right, so we've got four dudes. Let's cause ourselves some dis uh, destruction in this place. Is here a good place to start a fight? I don't think it would be. I think... Let's do it this way. We're going to go this way, guys. Come on down. We're going to get up into here. And we're going to start... Oh, my God! That was not a good thing to walk around the corner and find. Finding a sniper around the corner was not great. Let's kill the warden. All right. And we're going to kill a couple of people in here. We're going to see what we can do. Uh-oh. This is... This is... This is a meat grinder in here. I want to get... A, I want to get this lighter. Come on. Alright, no, that's the booze. I don't want booze. Oh, God, crap. Oh, and I'm dead. I died. After the sniper shot me, I then somehow died. 
Deary me. All right. Well, I guess I'm not getting out. Or maybe we, we count this as a do-over. We'll come back and try again next time. All right, friends. Thanks for watching. I'll see you then.